How's it going, mates? As Lost here, and welcome back to more Blind Dark Souls 2, the way to keep up with your schedule, asshole edition. Well, this place is a bit hectic. Up or down? Always go up before you go down. <laughs> there was no innuendo there, it's just that going down usually involves drops that you can't get back from. I should get a bunch of these and put them on a the pizza. Now that's some good eating. Oh! A shortcut. Fat Ken going down. Typical weekend. I'm not going to risk swinging my way off. I don't think I've died from a swing fall yet, have I? Once you start going down, you don't stop until you're done. That's the gentleman's code. This guy clearly isn't a gentleman. Which is why he gets inappropriately penetrated. Noise. I don't like all these drops. I can see your rapier sticking out, dude. I don't know why I even bother with the strong attack, but there you go. And it does what it says in the tin. Must be careful with where we stand. I think this is the ground floor. The Sontier loves pooches. I'd like to point out that Fakken loves animals. And these are all just rabid and or undead. Unfortunately, they need to be put down. Hmm. I've learned from my mistake. Not going to more hit a wooden chest again. I feel so educated now. Great. Pooch is hiding behind boxes. I fucking see you. Hey! It's going to be awkward as hell going up against groups with other weapons in the future after using this thing. I think that's it for this place. Freedom! Where is this? Oh, I think I might have seen this place from above. Nice garden. Some stellar foliage choices right there. Um, a lift. I think we'll clear down here first. Let's press on. That place looks kind of cool. Oh, God. Navland's bitchy sister. Oh my god! What the fuck just hit me? Overpowered mages, no fucking surprise there. You cheese me, I'm gonna fucking cheese you. Shit. There we go. God damn. It's always weird going from a mob like that back to... What is that noise? Fucking loud. It's not just him. It's gone quiet now. You heard that, right? Loud mechanical noises. That or I'm losing my fucking mind. Opens again. Aha. I think that might be another buddy. I'm getting all the boys back together for one last heist. What's your answer? You always could count on old Nigel. Right. Going up. Another shortcut, maybe? No. Oh, it is. We're back at the eye thing. This chest to the left is a lighter shade of grey. Get fucked, Mimic. It's like conquering your fears, except not really. <gasps> I know what that is. They had it in Dark Souls 1. I think some cosplay is in order. 
Now I am become Mimic, the eater of faces. These guys don't give a shit. Just gonna smack them up for free then. Oh, it's when something dies nearby. Ouch. And that should show time. No need for that, mate. We're gonna become friends, you and I. But you had to go and attack me. Yeah, those are the same fucking thing as the ones from Dronglight Castle. I bet I'm gonna get shit for not remembering. Ooh, curved grey sword. That looks cool. I bet it's got the shitty No? No, it doesn't. Look at that. Some nice horizontal action there. Whoa. Spin to win on a sword. Let's see what's tucked away over here. Gotta check those. Oh. Bunch of golems too. I see what this is about. Gonna make me fight one right next to you. You are, aren't you? Dickhead. Well, that's one down. But I don't think that bitch is gonna budge. Fuck it. We'll just have to slap the golem. There it is. Leg it. What an annoying corridor. Don't even care, mate. Let's hope it didn't wake the other one up. Nope. Kill things while they sleep. That's what they taught us back in school, anyway. Um, is that another night gate? Are you the final piece of the puzzle? Fred! Oh, Fred. I know you're a tire, but there's money and prostitutes involved. Midget prostitutes. Yeah, I thought he'd bite for that. Before we go up, I just want to see what's over here. Yep, it's a corridor. Long corridor for a single bit of loot. Not really buying that, I'll be honest with you. Let's have a closer look. Told ya. Too obvious. That's a drop though. Remember the rule, up before down. See what shenanigans are up here. Probably nothing special. Is that another shortcut? Maybe? Oh, it's the cathedral. Good work, team. I thought that drop was gonna hurt, but apparently not. Equip the um, cat ring and everything. Oh shit, there's two of them. Still gonna get fucked all the same though. Friend doesn't give a toss, does he? You're throwing spears at a gold medalist, dude. Oh, fuck. That was a bit sneaky. But it's all the same to fat Ken. Just more bitches to slap. I wonder how long before spinning becomes an impossible tactic. That's another drop. One moment, please. Found this shit on the floor. Huh, it's a frost lance thingy. A bit shitty that I can't throw them like they do. Go this way first. Nope. I waste so much health in these exchanges when I really don't need to. I think the infinite life gems has made me lazy as fuck. In Dark Souls 1, once you run out of Estus, you had no regen whatsoever. Until you use the bonfire again. That's the golem room, isn't it? I'd be interested to see how I handled Dark Souls 1 after finishing this game. Fire clutch ring. Buffs fire damage, right? Yep. Hot drop. Get down there. His weapon got stuck in the wall. Mimic. 
Has the light of grey always been so obvious? I feel kind of blind if it has been. Yay, a bow. Holy shit, though. That is a whole lot of bow. <laughs> can even smack people with it. Right, lads. Oh, wow, they're prepping up. I'm no good with public speeches. And I have no idea what the story behind this place is. All I know is the guy down there has loot, and we're going to pillage him. Also, sexy party afterwards. Never get tired of this entrance. Let's do it right this time. We're coming for you, motherfucker. Oh, that planet side hot drop, though. These guys don't even need me. Is this what it feels like to co op? I hope this doesn't make the fight trivial. But, um, as they freeze more shit, they die, don't they? I want that bitch at the end, mano a mano. There's one portal closed. There goes the second one. You know what to do, lads. There he goes. Third and final portal. Let's get this shit evened out. I'm letting him kill the final knight so I can get my jewel. Sorry, buddy. This is bigger than you. No ads, no bullshit, just two men, their weapons. No homo. Oh shit. Well, this isn't a good start, is it? Recover. Shit. He's gonna kill me. He's gonna fucking kill me. I will have my victory in the first duel. Got it? Come on, bitch. No! What am I doing? Right, no more lightsaber. Time to get some deeps in. And maybe some hills. I've got your rhythm, mate. Just one swing. He's too agile for more. Shit. Oh, he's buffing. Wasted my fucking opening. Fuck. Fuck. Run. I bet that leaves a mark. 40%. Just keep it cool. Yes. No. Jesus. He swings so fast. Stop dodging. I'm gonna run out of Estus. I know your moves now, man. And no butt buddies to back you up. Shit. Leg it. I staggered him? Weird. Know why they call him the Ivory King? Because he was always closely surrounded by his most loyal knights. If you know what I mean. Finish. Oh, you dick. Gotcha. That was a really good fight. No deaths once I figured out the freezing thing, but... I think technically there was three or four deaths before. I really enjoyed that. If it is possible to do this with two portals wide open, then I have no idea how, honestly. Way more DPS than I have is needed for the ads. I understand why they did that recruitment mechanic, but I don't like it. I think you should be able to one-shot every boss if you're good enough without outside influences like that, but like I said, it adds to the area outside, and probably really important for the story, so fair enough. This boss in this arena was so epic, I'm not going to nitpick that. Look at how cool this place is. It reminds me of, um, Isolith in Bed of Chaos. All that fire and branches and shit. A crown? 
A faint heat lingers in the ancient crown. I wonder if you can actually wear it, or if it's just a story item. I've got to do it, haven't I? <laughs> Pretty princess, Fat Ken. Fuck it, I'm keeping it. I don't give a shit about the stats. And we're back here. See what she has to say for herself. You've granted my one wish. I did. No, I have no regrets. I was born amidst the dark. That explains a lot. In the depths of the abyss. Oh shit! Fragment of menace. Yeah, I think so. And so, here I remain, heiress to my lord's wishes, watching over chaos. That sucks. Until the end of time. I hope the pension is good, dude. This is the sacred chime hammer from our buddy Velstad, whose armor we're desecrating just because of how fat it makes us look. I assume that casts miracles if you actually have points in faith. Ivory King Ultra Greatsword. Oh, our very own lightsaber. I like that. I like that a lot. Look at the durability though, that's... That's not really practical, is it? Even with the knuckle ring. Ooh. Ooh. Ivory straight sword. Like a mini version. Test drive. Yeah, it's got the longer range, but... Oh. Well, that hits pretty hard. Oh, this bitch. That durability, though, I... I can't do anything with that, man. Ooh. That's more like it. I want to see how much... Wow. That is like a fucking truck. Again though, look at the durability. How did I not see this ladder before? Alright mates, that's all from me. Sorry this week's schedule is all fucked up, but you know how it goes when RL gets a knockin'. On the plus side, I genuinely do think this DLC has been the highlight of the entire series, but we'll talk more about that tomorrow for reasons that will become obvious then. Get involved in the comments and let me know what your favourite area so far has been. It can be for any reason you want. Maybe the environment looks cool, maybe the enemies were interesting to you, or maybe you're a terrible person and enjoyed seeing me suffer in a particular area. Shame on you. Thanks for watching, thanks for your patience, and do subscribe if you'd like to see more videos. If you enjoyed it, like say with that like button as it helps me out and also expose the series to other people who might enjoy it just like you. I'll catch you mates tomorrow for the next one. This has been Asdos, and as always, I bid you a good night.